How are you fix? I'm Mama Cass. Welcome to my channel. Thank you for joining me. I appreciate all of you who stopped by and visit me from day to day. Um, I'm here with the other part of my haul from Mother's Day. Um, I got half delivered the other day and I showed you that. And now I've got the other half delivered. So I thought I'd show you quickly what I've got. So I've got two of these booklets. I use these for my crafting stuff as well, but um, these are like, they're a bit bigger than I need really, but I'll be able to put my stickers and my nail stamping things in them to keep them all nicely, maybe my foils as well. Um, I might look at getting a smaller one just for the stickers because they always come in small, but um, I got some lint free remover pads, like nail polish remover pads, because I realised that using anything with lint is really stupid. <laughs> Having tried the poly gel, I'm getting in a very sticky, hairy mess. Um, I got some of these tools, which is like the, I've got one, but it's a really big fat one that comes with the foils that I got. I didn't have a lot of luck trying the foils, so I'm going to do a couple of them soon. And I wanted a better sculpting tools to push them in place. So we'll give a go with them very, very soon um, and try the foiling because I, I didn't have much luck with it. And I do want to get the knack of it because I like the foils. They're pretty, aren't they? Um, then I've got, I've got some acrylic liquid monomer non-yellowing and then the free 100 mils i got of that there was like a 200 mil set that i wanted to get but i thought i would just get the smaller bottle for now see how i go with it um but that's for the acrylic powder kit that i got recently i'll show you that quickly <coughs> That's this one that I showed before on a haul. It's got the chalks with it. You can show you little pots. I'm going to need to get some more of these little pots. I'm not sure what size they are, to be honest. They might say on here. I was looking up for what ones to get. Dun, 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 dun. No, of course, it doesn't say on here. doesn't say what size they are but the acrylic powder is a four ounce jar and then you've got all of the color chalks to make all the different colors so i thought if i get a couple more of the little jars i can probably make up some quite a few different colors and try that that'll be fun and then i've got which also sort of will be used with in combination with this stuff is, hang on, I will show you, this, oh no, not that one, that was the wrong one, anyway, ha, ha, I'll get to the next bit in a minute, this is now dehydrator and primer, which is the best things to use to get your nails ready for, um, like, acrylic nails or the gel, poly gel nails, so I'm going to give that a go, I'm hoping that that'll help with the foiling as well, give it a better effect, I also got, um, excuse me, I also got these, which is um, gold foil. There's gold, silver, I don't know if you can see, gold, silver and copper in there. So that'll be fun, both for nails and for crafting. I like the fact that I can interchange a lot of bits between the crafting and the nails. It's good fun. Good fun. Right, and I've got this cute little thing, stamping nail art plate collection. This is just a single one that I got because it was so cute and pretty. Can you see that? Roses. And they really are quite posh. So, yeah, that's going to be fun. I like the stamping. That's been interesting. I quite enjoy that. Then I got these for adding mica as a chrome effect. 
which is sort of what I did here, but that wasn't very smooth. Um, but yeah, with these, hopefully it'll help to bit put the um, chrome effect on. Then I've got something else that I can interchange between the crafting and the um, um, nail art. These are probably the, use the bigger ones like this in crafting and the smaller ones on my nails. So that's fabulous and it's got one of the little wax pens and some tweezers which will come in handy for both. Really looking forward to trying that and I'm going to try that and add acrylic blobs over the top to really seal them in well. And then I got these stickers. Look at these. Wow. They are really pretty. So I'll show you these quickly just run through them. Because they are all short. I'm not sure. I don't think they're all different. But I don't know. Let's have a look. one as well. Of course we have the butterflies. Make believe. Bees and honeycomb. Zips. Oh. these on and it's very easy to do so you've got the purple mix 12 separate elements hand painted watercolor clipper cute that would have been nice for um, for St Patrick's Day or Remem Remembrance Day black and white ones pretty my favorite red and black Love it, love it, love it. There's quite a lot here, isn't there, really? I wouldn't 
I probably wouldn't use stickers on every hand. Flamingos. Pink flamingos. I like those colours. That's pretty as well. This will be fun. This is the dipping powder nail start kit, and it's got the activator and that in it. And then a little jar of acrylic powder, but I've also got the bigger jar of acrylic powder in this same company. Ta -da. Um, so I can make lots of different dipping powders with that and use it with this kit. And then I can also use the monomer with that kit to do acrylic nails. So, and I'm also going to try the poly gel again. So we've got lots to try out. I'm going to have lots of fun with it all. Thank you to my kids for um, Mother's Day, for loving me, for supporting me, for always being there for me. And um, thank you to you guys who um, tune in and watch me and keep me company from day to day. I love you all very much. Thank you ever so much. Goodbye.